The question comes up, how do we check the wattage output of a guitar amplifier? Well, if you look in the textbooks, they'll tell you to disconnect the speaker and hook it to a dummy load, and they'll tell you to disconnect the guitar and hook it to a signal generator. And they might even tell you how to use an oscilloscope. Well, I don't know who writes these textbooks, and I don't know about you, but I never play my guitar through a dummy load, and I never play a signal generator. I always play guitar. So what we've done here is we've hooked a meter up directly to the speaker leads of this amp. This is going to give us our voltage reading. We've got the meter set for AC voltage and from that we can determine the wattage. Now there's a there's a formula for this and we'll talk about this in a minute but let's just play a little bit of guitar. We'll look at the meter and see what the nominal voltage seems to be. Okay, it looks like it's around five volts showing on the meter. Now, most of us are familiar with Ohm's law, I equals E over R, and of course wattage equals current times voltage. We can manipulate the equation and come out with, eventually, voltage squared divided by resistance equals power. And that's what we're going to use here. We'll take our voltage, which is 5 volts. So we take 5 times itself, 